Valley. Oh my goodness! It's everything for your program when you can go into a kid's home and tell them who you're playing against every night. Book night with Athletic. Just incredible depth this year in the front court. Nice bounce pass down low and Book A young must strip. Mm. Here comes Book Knight. Ahead of the pack in the stat from Carrington Wallace. Here's Cole. Drops it down to Book Knight. Scores and he's fouled. If you look where he is, he's on the baseline. No more standing and shooting threes and uses the athleticism, the hanger. He's going to surprise a lot of people. And with plays like that defensively, I mean, he is you. dingy and he has an awareness. And then three he, in the foul. Does. He can change the game with plays like this. You recover late, he makes you pay. Moving sort of on the fly, but that's the plan right now. It's being planned to be just in one city. I think it just, this is a season where you have to, you know, expect the unexpected. You have to be ready to. Because the Hartford Hawks are the best at shooting threes in the American East. Great stutter. It's one of the keys to the game. UConn's going to push the pressure, fast break points. They're going to try to block shots, get rebounds, and get out the jitters uh, for the Hawks because UConn has played a game. But again, they're on the road and they're getting to the rim. He's blocking shots, as you see Polly did right there. I mean, you're going to have to keep these guys off the glass. Buck Knight, White, Mobley, Mobley, and Peterson. Worth noting, Ethan Anderson, and at least a quick glance. One game and about three and a half minutes. I get to a C by three. UConn basketball. Book Knight gets another. Book Knight here, floater, that'll go. To heat back a foot injury that caused him to miss a single game. Book Knight and plus one, he'll go to the lump. Where he's just dangerous. That's simple pump fake and going up against the best shot blocker on the floor still. Let them fly from deep, but also hit them. His team hits from beyond the arc at a 40% clip, and it's Damian Jefferson with the first triple. Book Knight with the answer. Good counter punch. Cole hits Zagorowski's pocket. Book Knight. Count the basket. Hockey defense. Cole there, laying it out. Gets on the floor. Book Knight picks it up. And the midair, oh, a three-pointer earlier this afternoon. The senior is so versatile on the offensive end. Book Knight, fall away. That's pretty. Martin trying to take it the length of the floor. Book Knight is everywhere. He's hit a double. Nothing there. He's open. Book Knight puts it up, puts it in. How about the it's physicality against Creighton's Highly efficient offense and rhythm. Book Knight, give him one more. Right, here's just that quick first step. Sizes up Mahoney. Able to get the angle, absorb the foul, and still finish. Defensive oriented. It is in the DNA of those types of teams. Book Knight has dominated on the baseline. And that's the Blue Jays' season average. Book Knight got the three. Well, he's in the zone, right? We need to. <laughs> Drinking my coffee over here. This is Book Knight. Another? Yes! <laughs> Who else do you put the ball into the hands of? It's Book Knight. Driving. Lays it in. Emerson. Back to back misses from deep. They see UConn again selling out. To Zagorowski, uh, basically a double team, especially when he comes off screens. Book Knight, count the bit here, a little between the legs, and then just a push, turns the corner. Two on two, three on three, reads, and he thought it really paid off the first couple games of the year. Book Knight, the two man game with Dave Lado promised a variety of defenders on Book Knight. Catch and shoot. Follows the miss, and now the shooting star for DePaul in the second half. Three for three. Carlton calling for it. It'll be... And now another one-out chance. One, two. Reconstituted, reformatted Big East. 
What a tremendous league it is. Look, nine ball to the American Athletic Conference. So back into the Big East this year, first season. Nice to have him. They can play off him. He's got a wonderful field. Turned to Jim Calhoun earlier, saying he just understands the game. That may have been a backcourt violation. Welcome back to the big time. And just a little lob. Polly. Oh my goodness! Welcome. He's missed the action. Take oh. a look at this. Bring it all. How about the rearrangement? Not only the. Dunk for exactly. Providence and UConn with two fouls. Watson, who takes that shot, has got two fouls as well. Uh, he's trusting him now as an upperclassman. Oh my goodness! Score the goal. Had to slide by him. Just body search a little bit, but right there, just that little cross gets the good angle, gets the call from the official. Nice little start for him. Duke trying to offer it up, but just a little sneaks inside and a clean block by Whaley. Book night the trailer sneaks inside off the window. Oh, and why not? He's the leader of the pack. Don't question a little pump the bite, a little blow by. And how about this? A sweet little kiss. He's all over. He can he can elevate there on Bynum. Book night swoops inside and scores. He may not be King James, there's only one king, but boy, it is pretty impressive this start. Little whoopsie. January 5th. <laughs> is that a lot of rest? Is That's that what right. you're suggesting? <laughs> Here's Book Knight. Turns the corner. Stays on the reins and off to Cole. Sophomore Book Knight. Little floater. Made by Carlton. Extra look for UConn. Book night, so smooth. Oh my! Rim, pretty impressive debut. He's back, and the Husky fans are going to enjoy it. Big time finish. Payne unable to convert off of the offensive rebound. This has been a seven nothing run for Marquette. Book night ends that. But he was looking for a whistle, didn't get it. Gaffney brings it down the floor, gives it up to Book Knight. Oh, beautiful maneuver. Theo John got a piece of this. They're calling a, a goaltend, which yep. is the right call. But he just doesn't wait. You know, if you would ask to know, if you're not up in the passing lane. Huskies were ready to blow him out of the building. That's 6-11, stepping out. Nice touch. Book Knight with a jab step maneuver. Drills it. Carlton with the dribble handoff to Book Knight. Actually, just a simple handoff. Here he is. That's a nice little handoff. And the foul difficulty we mentioned, and no Carlton. It'll be interesting to see if Marquette goes inside when they have the ball. Teardrop. Bank is open. The Baker's dozen with just under 12 to play. Book Knight off the curl. And it's right there for Sonogo. He was hesitant. <laughs> Recipe for a long afternoon. You see those three Connecticut players with four fouls. One of them, Sonogo, their lone big remains. Oh, yeah, and rattling it home. A tough matchup for Sonogo. Here's the matchup you want to see Book Knight versus Moore. Book Knight, tough shot. And pure talent. You've seen it from your coverage of the NBA. You can't do it all the time. You string it out, you trap it. Shaded a little bit. And he's lane. tough in that lane. And went the other way. Can't take your eyes off this kid, folks. Like all great guards, he can play on it. Loose ball, and it's rebounded by Connecticut. Here's Book Knight. Open court. Euro step off the window. Oh! And he got the run. And you're surprised. Yeah, exactly. Every time he lets it go. Book Knight swivels to the basket. From Howard sat last year at UConn, so he is really hitting his stride towards the end of this year. March. Now file this one away from March. Dan Hurley, two trips to the NCAA tournament with Rhode Island. And Book Knight. Book Knight. Book Knight fires again. Book Knight, perfect. A seeding boost win for Houston as well. And I think Penny Hardaway, that's him. I think they've won six in a row as Book Knight has just been in, in upset fashion. And Kemba was from the Bronze. Book Knight from Brooklyn. And Book Knight is ready. 
Book Knight has 14 so far for the Huskies, and he wants more. Book Knight puts it for six. Get it started for Book Knight. Book Knight into picket. The freshman year, they're not happy about being 9 and 11 at this point in their senior year, but playing better basketball down the stretch until the Huskies on the slot today, and it continues with James Book Knight. Tough going for, for both teams. Steve can't get Book Knight on the back pick. Oh, yeah! Run beautifully! They've got the first two field goals for Georgetown here in the second half. So off to a lot better start. Book Knight! Oh! Yeah, it, whether it's off the bounce or in the air, watch him just glide all the way to the basket, evade the shot blocker of Kudus Wahab. Just a tremendous athlete who's got good defense, gives him and go into the lane and hit those little floats. Backdoor cut. Ooh, again. UConn's next game is going to be against Marquette. That game's on Saturday. Book night, that may Book Knight. James Book Knight with some of Carlton way out front. Another one of those seniors that's been waiting for this moment. Pull up, up. it goes and Book Knight. Daphne trying to shake off Wiggins. Book Knight. Oh, that's creative. <laughs> guides it ahead. Here's Daphne with a head of steam. Jackson extra feed. Set up. Book it for Book Knight. Hey, sharing is the spin, more sell, and it taken away. UConn has missed 17 of its last 18 shots. Crossover, Book Knight gets to the rim. There's Book Knight. Gets back up. Harlem Globetrotters in.